Good morning students. Welcome back to your online class of environmental studies. Today what we are going to study? We are going to study today is our, our environmental studies. So in environmental studies we are going to study our continued chapter which was chapter number 13. And what was the name of the chapter number 13? The name of the chapter number 13 was the season what was the name of the chapter 13 the season okay so what we are going to do what we are going to do today in chapter number 13 the season we are going to do the notebook work what we are going to do today we are going to do the notebook work okay so let's begin let's begin with our notebook work first word what we have to do first you have to write first is today's date in your in the new page in your notebook and then write the name of the chapter that is the new the season and write the number of the chapter chapter number 13 the season and then write in the roman number one and then start new words in the first line write down new words okay then the first new word is cloudy what is the first new word Cloudy, C L O U D Y, cloudy, C L O U D Y, cloudy. What is the first word? Cloudy. I am repeating again. C L O U D Y, cloudy, C L O U D Y, cloudy. Then see the next word. Warm. Next word is warm. W A R M warm W A R M warm What is the second word W A R M warm W A R M warm Now see the third word weather Third word is weather W A A T H E R W E A T H E R weather W E A T H E R weather. Okay. Next word is sunny. S U double N Y sunny. S U double N Y sunny. So the first word was cloudy. C L O U D Y. Second word is warm. W A R M warm. Third word is weather. W E A T H E R weather. And fourth word is sunny. S U double N Y sunny. Now the next word is C cotton. C O double T O N cotton. C O double T O N cotton. Then next is woolen. W double O double L E N. W double O double L E N woolen. Next is September. S E P T E M B E R September S E P T E M B E R September Okay I'm going to repeat one more time September S E P T E M B E R September Then the next is wintry Next is wintry W I N T R Y wintry W I N T R Y wintry and then the next is umbrella. Next is umbrella. U M B R E L L A umbrella. U M B R E L L A umbrella. U M B R E L L A umbrella. Next is ourselves. Next is ourselves. O U R S E L V E S ourselves. O U R S E L V E S ourselves. Then, the question number second. Okay, leave one line after the new words, after writing all the new words, then leave the one line and then write in the next line, next new line, write down in the Roman number second and then write answer in one word. Then write answer in one word. Okay, so the first question of the answer in one word is what change within a very short time? What change within very short time? 
So the answer is weather. What change in a very short time? Weather. Weather changes. We had studied in our chapter that weather changes in a very short time. And the season remains for the long time. So what change within a very short time? Answer is weather. Okay. Now the question number second. What are the three main seasons in India? Answer me. What are the three main seasons in India? So the answer is here. Yes. Summer, monsoon and winter. Summer, monsoon and winter. The three main seasons in India are summer, monsoon and winter. So what are the two questions in one word? So the question number second first is Write down question number second in a new line. Answer in one word. And the first question of the answer in one word is. What change within very short time? So the answer is weather. And the question number second is. What are the three main seasons in India? So the answer is summer, monsoon and winter. Okay. Now let's going to the forward on the question number three. Let's see the question number three now. Which season comes after the hot summer month? Which seasons comes after the hot summer month? Yes, the answer is rainy season. Which season comes after the hot summer month? Answer is rainy season. Rainy season comes after the hot summer month. Okay, now see the question number four. In which season we wear light cotton clothes? In which season we wear light cotton clothes? So the answer is in summer season. In which season we wear the light cotton clothes? Answer is in summer season. In summer season. Okay, so we wear light cotton clothes in summer season. Next question is, which season is known as winter? Which season is known as winter? Answer is, cold season. Cold season, which we, which we are facing right now. Cold season is known as winter. Cold season is known as winter. So, the I am going to repeat the questions again. Question number 3 was, which season comes after the hot summer month? So, the answer is rainy season. Which seasons comes after the hot summer month? Answer is rainy season. Then the in the continuation, write down the question number 4. In which season we wear light cotton clothes? In which season we wear light cotton clothes? So, the answer is in summer season. So, in which season we wear the light cotton clothes? We wear light cotton clothes in summer season. Then the question number 5, which season is known as winter? Which season is known as winter? Cold season is known as winter. Cold season is known as winter. Okay, so which season is known as winter? Cold season is known as winter. Now see the next question. Now after leaving this, after this, leave one line. After writing, answer in one word. Then leave one line and then write. In the Roman number 3 and then writing answer the following and start writing answer the following. First of all you all have to do the work in a very neat and clean handwriting. Okay and then write answer the following and here is our first question of answer the following is what is the difference between weather and the season? What is the difference between Weather and the season. Okay. So the answer is. The weather can change. Within a short time. The weather can change. Within a short time. But the season have the same weather. For long time. The weather can change. Within a short time. As I told you. The weather can change in within a short time. But the season have the same weather for long time. The season have the same weather for long 
time. So I'm going to repeat the question again. Write down in the Roman number 3. And then write answer the following. Answer the following. And the first question of answer the following is. What is the difference between weather and the season? What is the difference between the weather and the season? So the answer is. The weather can change within a short time. The weather can change within a short time. But the season have the same weather for long time. But the season have the same weather for the long time. Okay. So what is the difference between the weather and the season? Answer is the weather can change within a short time. But the season have the same weather for long time. Now let's move towards the question number two. Question number two is name the three seasons. Name the three seasons. Write a sentence about write a sentence about what happened during each season. First what you have to do you have to write the name of the three seasons and then you have to write a sentence about what happened during each season. Okay. So the answer of this is in summers days are long and sunny. First we have to tell which are the seasons. The first season is in summers. Okay. Then we have to write each sentence about them that is days are long and sunny. In summers days are long and sunny. Okay. In summers comma days are long and sunny. Then in the second Second uh, season is in monsoon. What is the second season? Monsoon. So in monsoon. Then comma. Then write the sentence about that. That is days are cloudy and it rains very often. Days are cloudy and it rains very often. Okay. So the first season is summer. So in summer days are long and sunny. We had read in the uh, chapter. And then the second is in monsoon. In monsoon days are cloudy and it rains very often. Now the third. Third season is which is famous in the idea in winters. In winters. In winters days are short and nights are long. Days are short and nights are long. So, I am going to repeat one more time. Question number two. Name the three seasons. Name the three seasons. Write a sentence about what happened during each season. Write a sentence about what happened during each season. Answer is, in summers, days are long and sunny. In summers, days are long and sunny. In monsoon, days are cloudy and it rains very often. In monsoon, days are cloudy and it rains very often. In winters, days are short and nights are long. In winters, days are short and nights are long. So, this is our question number 2. Now, let's move towards question number 3. See, what is our question number 3? What kind of clothes do we wear during the following season? What kind of clothes do we wear during the following season? So, here we have given some seasons. Here we have given the seasons first. Summer. We wear cotton clothes during summer. We wear cotton clothes during summer. So, what kind of clothes do we wear during the summer? We wear cotton clothes during summers. We wear cotton clothes during summer. Now, the next season is winter. So, what kind of clothes do we wear during the winters? We wear woolen clothes during the winters. We wear woolen clothes during winter. I am going to repeat the question again. Question number 3. What kind of clothes do we wear during the following season? What kind of clothes do we wear during the following season? So answer is summer. We wear cotton clothes during the summer. We wear cotton clothes during summer. And then the next season is winter. Which kind of clothes do we wear in the winter? We wear woolen clothes 
ड्यूरिंग विंटर वी वियर वुलन क्लोथ ड्यूरिंग विंटर देन आफ्टर दिस यू हैव टू राइट द क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर इन द रोमन नंबर राइट डाउन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर विच इज मैच द एंटोनियम्स मैच द एंटोनियम्स एंटोनियम्स मीनिंग इज ऑपोजिट्स एंटोनियम्स आर ऑपोजिट वर्ड्स ओके सो मैच द एंटोनियम्स फर्स्ट वर्ड इज समर सेकेंड इज हॉट थर्ड इज माउंटेन्स फोर्थ इज लॉन्ग एंड द फिफ्थ इज रेनी फर्स्ट इज समर सेकेंड इज हॉट देन इज माउंटेन देन इज लॉन्ग देन इज रेनी एंड इन द बी साइड इट इज कोल्ड प्लेन्स विंटर्स डे शॉर्ट कोल्ड प्लेन्स विंटर्स डे शॉर्ट Now what we have to do? We have to match the following. Okay, so match the antonym of summer. So the antonym of summer is cold. No. What is the antonym of summer? The sum antonym of summer is plains. No. Does the antonym of summer is winter? Yes. So the on winter write down one. The antonym of summer is. The antonym of summer is winters. That is the opposite of summer is winter. Then hot. What is the opposite of hot? Does the opposite of hot is cold? Yes. So match hot with cold. So write the number two on cold. Write the number two on cold. Match hot with cold. Match hot with cold. Then next is mountains. What is the antonym of mountains? What is the antonym of mountains? Does it plains? Yes, mountains are the slopes, or we can say highlands, and plains are the flat land. So they are totally antonyms of each other and opposites. So write down three on plains. Write down three on plains. Then long. What is the Opposite, or we can say antonym of long. Does it day or short? It's short. The antonym of long is short. So write down four on short. Write down four on short. And the what is the opposite of rainy? What is the opposite of rainy? What is the opposite of rainy? I am going to match it again one more time. Summer, winter that is one. Hot, cold that is two. Mountain, plains that is three. Long, short that is four. And the rainy day. Day that means a sunny day. So the opposite of rainy is day. So that is five. Okay. So these are the antonyms. Summer antonym is winter. Hot antonym is cold. Mountain antonym is plains. Long antonym is short. Rainy antonym is day. So this is all about the chapter number thirteen, which you have to do in your book and the notebook, and also study from the book. So study it well and stay safe, stay well at your homes. Thank you so much.